Sure. Okay, Americanos. Show me the dinero. I bet you're going to end up with a hole in your head. Watch these. Very nice. Estás loco? Hola, muy buenos días, señor. Qué bravo es el gringo. You are todo hombre, my friend. Capitán de Santa solo permite que yo le toco a su pistola. No me hables de esas babosadas. Good, but not good enough. Ya basta. Blood in the game, amigo. Lo siento. Babosos. Casi me mató. ¿Cómo está? You have plenty cojones, amigo. Give me someone serious this time. Señor Maston, you must make your bet. You must see the fast cuchillo of the gunsmith. And you didn't even lose a finger. You didn't see that coming, did you? It's not just guns I Hola, master. Señor. Cuchillos, too. That's the best you got. Siento, señor Martón. Did it hurt? Basta. <laughs> Cuidado. No llores, señor Martón. Must Demonio. not cry. No. There you go. Someone else want to challenge me? How much? All right. Close your eyes. Money's down, yeah, mister. I thought we were trying to do this quickly. Too damn slow. Demonios! You're a little too enthusiastic. ¿Qué tal, señor? And there it is, mister. Bueno, watch very carefully. Not bad. Perhaps poker is more your game. Qué mal abuelo. Buenos días. Guess I'll have to come back and beat you. You want to play? Why not?
Ándeles lindas, impatrióticas. Dale, que ustedes son putas y lo saben. Por favor, no me hables. Oh, mi amor, nadie te está obligando a hacer nada. Solamente quiero que animes al hombre que va a salvar a tu padre. ¿Tú quieres a tu padre, cierto que sí, linda? What's going on here, Captain DeSena? Just a little recruitment. Nothing for you to be concerned about. You boys using women soldiers now? Our customs are none of your concern. Apparently not. The Santa Mariconcito! Me encontraste algunas chicas. Ay, mamacita. ¿Dónde has estado toda mi vida? Ven, ven, mujeres. Ay, me gusta. The two Patriots were keen to make your acquaintance, ah, the Coronel. Fantastic. I love Patriots. Ah, he's like a Marston. You here to fight the war? And we shall make a patriot of you yet. I hope so. <laughs> Any word of those men? Oh, yes. I heard they were riding with Reyes. I wanted to talk to you about it. Uh, the Santo, uh, hable con él. Tell him what I wanted. <laughs> His Excellency, El Coronel, would like to employ you in escorting a train down rebel country. The job is dangerous. But you'll have the honor of... <laughs> Man, <you know. laughs> Another patriot? Of knowing that you said Mexico in her fight against forces that would destroy our society. How much you offer? 20,000 pesos. And information as to the whereabouts of Javier Escuella. <laughs> okay, then. Mexico loves you, Mr. Martin. She has a funny way of showing it. with us. Vamos! We must leave now. Vamos, muchachos! Ringo! Ringo, are you listening to me? Does it seem quiet to you? I don't know. You tell me. We have not seen a single rebel yet. I'd say that's a good thing, wouldn't you? Doesn't feel right to me. We're on our way to escort a train through rebel held country. An ambush feels about right to me. Soldado! ¿Quién eres? ¿Cuál escuadrón? Somos nuevos reclutas, Capitán. Es nuestra primera asignación. I knew I had not seen these men before. They are new recruits. En escalera. People have been talking about the rebels planning a large attack. If these supplies are so important, why have we been given so few soldiers? Don't ask me. You're the captain. I thought you were supposed to be fearless. I am fearless, but not brainless. There is something wrong. I feel it. 
Maybe you just need to take a piss or something. The colonel told me that the Santa had praised my actions at Torquemada and called me a hero. He asked for me to be given this important assignment. Why would he do that? Yes, it seems to be on schedule. At least one thing is going right for us. I agree. We ain't off to a good start. You shoot well, gringo. Tell me something. What is your weapon of choice? What do you mean? Come, my friend. Your belt is full of weapons. Which is your favorite for attacking a man? We are close to Chuparrosa now. I still have a bad feeling about this. Tell me, why are you here? What did they promise you? 20,000 pesos to Javier Escuela. That is a lot of promises. Do you know where Escuela is? You think I am going to tell you that before you have fulfilled your obligations? Do not take me for a fool. I've given you no reason not to trust me. You must understand why we are suspicious of you. Most American vigilantes come here to help the rebels. It is strange you have chosen to work for the army. I'm not working for you. How many times do I have to say this? Call it what you want, gringo. We are exchanging favors then. I ain't seen many favors come my way yet. Abraham Reyes is trying hard to recruit gringos to fight for him. His propaganda is everywhere. He promises women, gold, and, of course, you come. Money and the chance to interfere in business that is not your own. How can any American resist? Here we are at last. Colados, abordamos the train. I do not think we have seen the last of the rebels. You recruits can't win a fight like this. I need you to man the Gatling gun. I ain't the soldier here, Captain. Do not question me, gringo. Just do as I say. Take your position now. I hope you know how to use that gun. Can't be that hard. Just point and pull the trigger. For Dios! We will all be killed. Don't worry, Captain. I've used one of these before. For a cold-hearted killer, you're an anxious son of a bitch, ain't you? Stop! Do not shoot until I tell you! We have all... Don't point that at me! I think it is right to be anxious. No brave men need to decide today. Just a coward. Yeah, well, I wasn't exactly expecting a pleasant picnic by the seaside myself.
think that's all of it. We do not have far to go. If you were going to shoot me, you would have done it already. That was madness. You did well, compadre. Very well. Whatever I get the promise to in return, you have earned it. I don't think the Santa expected us to come back from this. Did you want to kill him, or should I? No. Until I find a squala, he's more used to me a lot. Senor Marston, thank you for your efforts. The escort was a success. At least some of your men survived. I didn't think to survive myself. My whole life I have dreamed of a glorious death. <laughs> Vamos! Rapido antes uh, que nos ataquen otra vez. These socialist pigs cannot be allowed to win. Muy interesante. Gracias, amigos. Mr. Marston, how the devil are you? I'm fine. How are you, Mr. Ricketts? I'm good. I'm glad you're here because these men were just telling me about Mr. Escuela. Javier Escuela? Emilio, let me ask you something. His nombre is Javier, Senor Escuela? Is Javier to see? No sé, Senor. I got that bit. Ask him 
Was he about five foot eight? Mustache? Did he have an American in tow? A big American? Emilio, the Stabacone, uh, Grande Americano? Yo no sé. No. Ag again, I got that. But they do have his sister. Emilio's, I mean. She's a fine young woman, a teacher, a human being, not the clothed vermin so many people seem to have turned into. Tell him I'm sorry. When a man's family is involved, you need a little more enthusiasm than mere apologies. I have enough worries, sir. This man's problems pay me, but they're not quite my own. Those who sit on the fence make a choice in their own way. Don't you think, Mr. Marston? Of course. And what about you, Ricketts? A man living in the past? A man who ran away from home? What choice did you make? I'll tell you what choice I made. I'm a fighter, sir. And I'll fight to the end. I think we should get going. I'm gonna take the train. You can come with me or ride ahead to El Matadero. I've been hearing some things about you, John Marston. Really? That perhaps you're more in need of my help than I thought. Is that so? That some recent encounters with this Bill Williamson fella haven't gone exactly in your favor. Funny how everyone seems to know my business, but nothing about the men I'm looking for. It isn't easy getting the locals to talk. It's the only way to travel, so they keep telling me. We'll get off at Casa Madrugada and ride from there. There should be some horses for us across the way. All right, let's head to El Matadero and see what they know about Luisa. We need to find a man called Carlos. I was told he could help us. We'll ask around when we get there, but we don't want to draw attention. See if you can keep your gun holstered for once. You're the hero around here, Mr. Ricketts, not me. What does the army want with this Luisa girl, anyway? She's a rebel, and apparently close to their leader, Reyes. She's a pretty young thing. That's normally reason enough for Alinde. So I've heard. She's a good woman, a teacher. If they lay a finger on her, I swear I'll feed those bastards their balls. Looks kind of sleepy, don't it? Easy now. All right, let's find this Carlos guy. Carlos. See? Si. We're here for Luisa. Is she still being held up in the caves? Yes. She's still up there. Who's the cowboy? We're here to help. Mm, muy bien. I can distract the guards. You and the gringo can get inside. Let's do it. 
I will keep them talking, senor. The rest I will leave to you. All right, let's find Luisa. ¿Qué quieres? ¡No puedes estar aquí! Hace calor hoy. Bien bochornoso, ¿verdad? ¡No lo voy a decir otra vez! ¡No puedes estar aquí! Eh, oye, soy yo, Carlos. Pues trabajo en el matadero. No me importa quién eres. Esta es una zona militar prohibida. Vete a casa. Me gustan sus botas. Muy bonitas. Mi hermana tiene las mismas. Pinche campesino de mierda. Te voy a colgar al lado de tus cerdos. ¡Váyanse al infierno, traidores! That's our cue. The entrance is down this way. <laughs> Aim at the goddamn soldiers! ¡Te voy a matar! Stop that! Drop that bastard, Marston. Jesus! Oh, no, you don't. No. If you laid a finger on her, come on, stay with me. My lord, don't give him any room. Who you boys steal them uniforms off? Must be this door. Looks like we might need a little dynamite to get it open. Keep watch while I get it ready. What the hell? What have we got here? Deal with those bastards, Marston. You're dead! We're toast! Stand back, damn it! Here goes! Come on, boy! Poor girl's barely alive. Let's get the hell out of here before any more of them show up. We need to push forward. What have you got for me?
Looks like Carlos left us some horses. Come on! <laughs> Let's go before any more of them show up. Come on! Luisa, gracias a Dios. Thank you for saving me. You're a good man. Friends of the people of this land. Was someone named Harvey Escuela one of the men holding you? No. I don't know. I don't think so. But I remember that name from prison. Bad people spoke of him. I told you John, he's still in Mexico. Okay, then. I guess we'll keep looking. Damn.